This is, uh, it's a bad idea. So you said last night when you booted me out. Look, it's, uh, it's for the best. Right. That's why we both got so much sleep. You look terrible, by the way. Yeah, I've been out most of the night walking, just trying to clear my head. Good. Maybe you can clear mine and explain what the hell is going on. Okay, so you get a phone call last night, and next thing I know, you're kicking me out. So the call was about Sonny, right? Look, the timetables have been moved up, which means Sonny's case is going to be over soon, which means everyone's going to know I'm a cop. Okay. No, that's not okay. Not for us. I can't be with you. There's no way this can work. Okay, then help me out here, because I thought last night... Didn't you say that you loved me, and I'm pretty sure I said I loved you, too. I do love you. So you're not taking it back? No, Lulu, I'm not taking that back. Good. That's all that matters. Just loving each other. The rest is just details. That's why I came over here last night to talk about Elizabeth and Lucky because I know that I can say anything to you and feel safe. Look, we're, I mean, we're on our way to having sex and I mean, I still would have even if you hadn't said that you loved me, but they kicked me out. Because when Sonny is busted, we don't stand a chance. So are you saying that when Sonny's busted, you're just gonna like take off and change your name and cover your tracks and I'm not gonna hear from you again? Look, I'm saying that there's gonna be a fallout. Then we'll deal with it. What do you think I can do? Just reveal myself as Dante Falconeri, undercover cop, send Sonny to prison and, and just go on with my life like I closed a business deal? You think we can keep dating, going to the opera and meet for coffee at Kelly's? There's no way I'm putting you in that position. Wait, so this is about protecting me? Sonny's men are gonna want to retaliate. Okay, and I don't want you anywhere near me when that happens. Wait a minute, you, I'm sorry, you still haven't said what you're gonna do once Sonny's arrested. Okay, what if I say you're right? What if I say I'm gonna change my name and run for my life? Would you come too? Would you leave your friends and your family and your career? Would you come with me? Was your question real or rhetorical? Just answer it. Would you give up everything and run away with me or not? No. Because? Because I can't leave my life in Port Charles, and I've done it once before under different circumstances, and it was a disaster. That's my point. You are exactly. so frustrating. What? Running away is your only solution. After all this cocky bragging, things get tough, and you just give up. Look, we can stay together if I compromise this case against Sonny, but then I'd be failing in my duty and failing myself. And then I wouldn't be worthy of you. I have to see this through. Fine. Just don't expect me not to hope that we can still be together. Look, I'll make you a deal. If I live through Sonny's arrest, I'll come back and we'll have that conversation. 